guys, I have a special treat for you today. I have a customer looking for a V8 Mustang convertible with a manual transmission. And a buddy of mine who sells cars just down the street just happens to have one. And it's a 2017 GT and it's a California edition. So we are going to take this thing down to show the customer and hopefully we can make a little bit of a deal here and uh, see if it's something that he's you know, excited about, just like I am, and uh, looking forward to taking it for a little drive as well. So we're gonna put the top down and we're gonna go for a little bit of a cruise. We'll see you in a minute. back to 
So I'm driving through town and I see this Hyundai, which I'm really not sure what it is yet. It might be one of these new Kona or whatever they call it. Um, I see it sitting off to the side waiting to pull out in the traffic. So anyways, it pulls behind me and it's got all this body cladding that's actually quite ugly. Anyways, I'm going to pull over uh, up here in just a moment. Hopefully he stays behind me long enough so that you guys can see what it is. I'm not sure if you can see it uh, back there right now. Um, but anyways, it's, uh, it's not a very good looking car. And I, I like Hyundai. I, I like their styling. They seem to always be ahead of everybody else. But anyways, I'm going to pull over right here just for a second so you guys can see this. Now, I'm not sure if you got a good look at that or not, but she ugly. And now I'm going to go see if I can catch up to it and follow it and maybe get a better, uh, better look at it. And before I post this video, I'll review it and see if I got a good picture. If I didn't, then I'll find one and I will post it. Oh, he's pulling into the Irving, so that's good. I'm going to go pull up and see if I can't get a better view of this car. And of course, he's pulling into a parking spot with vehicles on both sides. Anyways, there it is. She ain't got no alibi. She ugly. And if you know who sings that song, you can stick it in the comments. Well, folks, the time has come to say goodbye to the shop truck. Just like the red Mustang when you're in the car business, everything is for sale. I had a customer come in today looking at the white 09. And it was just a little bit more than what he wanted to spend. So just on a whim, I mentioned this truck. And of course, this has the plow and the tow package and everything. And that really appealed to them because they were looking at buying a camper. So the shop truck is going probably not till first week because we are selling it to a U.S. customer. So it will be going uh, out of the country uh, just next door to Callis, Maine. Here is a look at the truck as it sits now. So we're going to take it in and get our decals off of it, get her all cleaned up and ready for sale. When I told Junior just a few minutes ago when he came in uh, to work that I had sold it, I almost saw a sparkle of tear in his eye. He's a little bit upset with me for selling the truck shop. Ugh. He's a little upset with me for selling the shop truck. He really liked that truck. So anyways, it is what it is. I told him the next one will just simply be better. So we'll be on the market for, in the market for a new shop truck. So I don't know. I'm thinking next time we're going to go with a three-quarter ton. And uh, we'll see what's out there. Maybe a Dodge, maybe a Ford, maybe another GM. Who knows? So stay tuned. Now we got one side done. Half the battle is getting the vinyl off, the other half is getting the sticky stuff off. Alex is loving it though. Mm. Doing the fingers. <laughs> Twin turbskis.
Looks and looks.